Hey YouTube, just want to show you all my pitcher plant indoors. This is right after I fertilized it with coffee. I used the distilled water inside the coffee, put it, watered it, let it set for a day, flushed it out. And uh, the leaves really do grow from coffee, like, oh man. And the pitchers get more elaborate when they have more nutrients. So it's got more hairs on these ones. I, I, I mean, I've seen some pitchers where they're, when they're younger, the younger pitchers have more hairs, but this one seems to, once it's gotten a little bit more energy, once it's pitchers started uh, getting some nutrients, then it started making the pitchers more red. But yeah, how you make the pitchers grow every day, spray the little tips. It doesn't need direct sunlight. I'm lucky that I have a little bit of direct sunlight on it right now. But you can really grow it um, a little bit brighter than a normal orchid. Actually quite a bit brighter. Um, but yeah, just spray it every day. Put some random insects in there. Because it's not going to catch enough for itself inside. Uh, yeah, just water it with coffee. Water it with water in the next day. It's pretty much everything. It's actually a really easy plant to take care of. It's really beautiful. These are like flowers. And they stay for weeks and weeks and months and months and that until they finally go. And they only get prettier every week. Every week you'll probably get another one. If your plant is warm enough, the colder it is, the slower it will grow. It's a tropical plant, so it likes to be warm. It doesn't like to be humid all the time, though. People like to keep these in like a little humidity dome. And then if I see, I've seen the tip of mine just grow fungus hairs and then it just died. That's when I first got this. And I was like, you know, that's not gonna work out. So just spray the tips every day. Um, it's not really picky on how much water it gets. Oftentimes, if there's a little bit of water inside the pitchers, it'll also keep it hardy and they can absorb water from the pitchers. So, yeah, really, pitch plants are really easy plant to grow. This is a north-facing window. There's north, there's west, or no, there's east, because that's the morning sun. There's west, north, directly. If you look at the sun, rising and setting. North is the best window, because during the winter months, it goes like that. And if we were on the other side of the house, it would go like that, and you would... Or it would still be over here, but on the other side of the house. So, north-facing window. It sucks if you don't have a north-facing window. A east or a west-facing window would also be good. Or a northeast or a northwest. But if you don't have that, then you really got to, to grow one of these. You don't need a humidity dome or anything, though.